Hello everyone, Mipa here, trying to make your Monday a little better and maybe even something to look forward to. As usual, two more pages for you. Here we are! <laughs> With how Dr. Arcade has been speaking in these recent pages, I'd like to point out I don't know if any of you noticed this tiny detail, but occasionally there are emphasized words and they are slightly bigger than the rest of the words in his statements. And those are annoying <laughs> to me. <laughs> if you thought I was going to reveal some like hidden meaning behind it or something, no, they're just annoying to me. But I, it feels important in how he's speaking, so I have to find some way to emphasize them. And unless I choose to, like, trace over them or something, I can't, like, bold them or italicize them or something. So I need to make them bigger. But in Abyss Paint, you can't... <laughs> you can't make just one word bigger within a text box so I need to make them their own text box just for that one word in his sentence and then I need to figure out how to string the then multiple text boxes together and <laughs> we're starting this off with me just instantly venting about his little speech pattern here and the troubles it's giving me in abyss paint but I just I just needed to mention it <laughs> because he keeps doing it and every time I add it in the script I think, ugh, I'm gonna have to deal with this later because of abyss paint issues. <laughs> and nothing against abyss paint, this is just <laughs> low-key annoying to me and I needed, I needed to vent. Because what better place to vent it to than to the people already taking the time to come look at and hopefully appreciate the drawings I'm doing. So, yes, I just needed to say that. And I've tried to make it easier on myself in a couple spots. Like, for the fifth panel on here, you can see the bigger text is just its own thing with nothing attached so that obviously makes stringing it together easier the expression on that same panel that fifth one is also amusing to me on how it turned out because <laughs> he just looks so sneaky or cheeky or something like <laughs> It's just a face of pure he's up to something, and I find it really funny. I don't know why. Like, when I drew it, I was like, is this really the vibe I'm going for? But then I also couldn't bring myself to change it either. So he's just left with this little sly expression, like he's, ju he's just up to something. Which, I mean, he is, and that's very clear. So, good for him, I guess. I just find it funny, as you can tell. It's the little things in the comic that bring me joy. <laughs> but... How time flies already, it's been four minutes, and that's all I have for you this week. Event and a little thing I find amusing. So, ending it there so I don't ramble more than I need to. I hope you all have an amazing week, everybody. Goodbye!